Sister Wives, Christine Brown gives fans a tour of her new $676,000 Airbnb. And Mary Brown and new BF Amos already struggling. Also fans feel duped after missing Cody and Robin's early red flags. Hey lovely viewers, welcome to my 2S gossip channel. Sister Wives star Christine Brown likes exploring new things with her husband, David Woolley. The TLC audience loves to get new updates on the couple and their new adventures. Christine, on the other hand, loves sharing new recipes with her audience. She is also a part of TLC's Cook with Christine show. The reality TV star built a huge fan base due to her cooking videos apart from the reality TV show. Moreover, fans of the series know Christine for actively promoting the products of an MLM company. Recently, she shocked everyone after opening up about her new business plans. She opened up about the reasons for her visit to Moab in a special post. The TLC star informed her fans that she and her husband had bought a new place to build an Airbnb. Moreover, she also gave her fans a quick tour of her new place. Christine Brown is the perfect example of aging like fine wine. Her strength and determination are only intensifying with her age. The Sister Wives star has been surprising everyone with her new version. She is not willing to sit back and live a boring life after entering her 50s. Fans have been thinking that Christine already has a lot on her plate right now. But she surprised everyone. After opening up about her new business, she took to Instagram to reveal her new Airbnb in Moab. The TLC star posted a lovely picture with her husband, David Wally, while posing in front of the snowy mountain backdrop. She revealed that she and her husband now have an Airbnb in Moab, Utah. Interestingly, their new place is only 30 minutes away from the place where they tied the knot. Christine shared a few glimpses of her Airbnb. She shared the picture from the outside of her new home with a large moon decoration beside the front door. The TLC star also shared a picture of her fully furnished hallway with an L-shaped brown couch and a kitchen bar at the back. Further, she shared a snap of her bedroom with warm-toned furnishing. Christine ended her post after sharing a glimpse of the living area of her home with another couch and a large wall-mounted TV. The Sister Wives celeb informed her followers that the booking will be available soon and she will share the link to help them in booking the place. Sister Wives Christine Brown owns the $676,000 Moab home. Sister Wives star Christine Brown has been surprising her fans with her new life decisions. Recently, The Sun exclusively revealed that the TLC star is now the owner of her $676,000 property in Moab, Utah. Now, Christine and David are planning to rent the same. Christine shared a link on her social media to help her followers book the place. A source revealed that the TLC celeb purchased her new rental on January 8, 2024. However, David's name was not on the listing, which sums up the fact that Christine is the sole owner of the property. The exact amount is not available to the public because of the non-disclosure deed. However, the real estate listings estimated that the property must be of around $676,000. Sister Wives star Mary Brown is getting a lot of attention following her sudden silence about her new boyfriend, Amos Andrews. He was last seen in the 53-year-old's weekly IG livestream last month, in which he clarified some facts about himself, including his three divorces. Some fans began to worry for the California native due to her partner's past, and it seems her recent cryptic post may hint at their possible struggles. Some Redditors previously discussed Mary's new boyfriend after revealing his past marriages on IG Live. According to Amos, he was divorced three times, shutting down the rumors that he had four failed marriages. The Sister Wives star even joked about how she's one up against him as she had three ex-sister wives and an ex-husband. However, several Reddit users think Amos's past is already a big red flag. There are also reports that he's refusing to pay child support for one of his ex-wives, Shannon. Well, there it is. Mary, get away. Honestly where did they find these losers? Yet another deadbeat dad in these women's lives. I really wanted to have faith that Mary was finally healing and doing the work to a healthy life. But this, she ain't learned st, sorry. What was the point of even leaving Cody just to get with this dude? He sounds as bad as Cody. 
The only difference is that he's willing to lay the pipe. Mary needs therapy. Not blaming her at all, but Mary is damaged. Comprehensive therapy before any new marriage or relationship. Mary is signing up to be hurt. Again, Mary and Amos already struggling. Mary took to IG stories to share a cryptic quote about looking for the good side in every situation. You gotta look for the good in the bad, the happy in the sad, the gain in the pain, and what makes you grateful not hateful, the sister wives star said. Her post comes after the backlash Amos Andrews faced after his past marriages were exposed. Mary Brown's puzzling quotes are nothing new to the fans. She likes to post cryptic messages online during her struggles with Cody. But it also appears that her latest post is a message for the internet trolls to stop looking into her boyfriend's past. Mary has also been busy with her business amid her silence about Amos. Recently, the Sister Wives star shared that her B&B in Utah will host a street. Patrick's Day Tour According to the reality TV personality, she will share stories while touring with her guests in her street. Patty's Style, B&B She's also asking for $50 per head, while kids under 3 are free. Mary Brown faced backlash due to the overpricing of one of her B&B retreats last year. But it seems that she has learned from her mistakes this time due to the reasonable fee of her street. Patrick's Tour Sister Wives fans feel silly for failing to notice Cody and Robin's toxic personalities. The Brown family's collapse was too obvious from the start. Many Sister Wives viewers are disappointed that they didn't foresee Cody Brown and Robin Brown's personality flaws that destroyed their polygamous family. Cody and Robin's journey began in 2010 when they debuted on the TLC series alongside Mary, Janelle, and Christine Brown. The big family seemed extremely close and showed love for each other. Unfortunately, Cody became increasingly distant from his other partners in the following years. He chose to spend time with Robin over everyone else, hurting his other wives. The situation got so tense that Mary, Janelle, and Christine left Cody after the COVID-19 pandemic. In a Reddit thread created by Downtown underscore list underscore 4824, fans shared that they felt stupid for not seeing Cody and Robin's real truth. Some rewatched the older seasons and realized that the red flags were evident from day one. The op commented, I really do feel dumb, asking others if they also missed all the signs. We were all duped. Cody seemed like a good guy. Love your web replied, we were all duped. Cody seemed like a good guy. The first few Sister Wives seasons showed Cody as the ultimate patriarch who loved to expand his family. While Robin looked like someone who respected polygamy. However, viewers now realize they were both manipulative. Cody and Robin have used different manipulation tactics to control their family members while being the center of attention. The Brown family patriarch manipulates people by gaslighting them and putting them down. In one episode, he told his former third wife, Christine, that he wasn't attracted to her, killing her self-confidence. Similarly, he once told his Mary to move to his barn, insulting her enough to make her quit and go away. Robin has manipulated others by acting like a victim. She frequently bursts into tears to make others feel sorry for her, which often works. Viewers are right about overlooking the red flags. However, it isn't their fault for expecting a positive outcome and wanting the Brown family to stay together. The audience gets attached to reality TV stars as they watch the cast members' journeys over the years. As such, it's natural for fans to hope the best for Cody and his four wives. Maybe viewers didn't just overlook the issues but also put their trust in all five main cast members. They wanted Cody to show maturity and hoped he'd fix things. They expected the big polygamous family to overcome their problems. Sadly, the Brown family has now fallen apart. However, it's been for the best that Mary, Christine, and Janelle left Cody. Seeing Mary regain her confidence and glow after tossing Cody out of her life is amazing. She has found a new boyfriend and spends her time traveling with him. Christine and Janelle are also doing great now. The former recently married her soulmate, David Woolley, during a two-part Sister Wives special, and the latter has begun living her life on her own rules. What do you think about this video please told on comment box also subscribe our channel. Thanks for watching this video.